Hey, good morning, everyone. Happy Friday. It's the 20th of July. Um, was up, uh, was it 5, 5-ish, five 5.15-ish? Five uh, I was trying to get up a little early, but it's just been, um, you know, our daughter's getting to that point when, you know, it just gets really rambunctious at the end of the night. I mean, if you're parents, you understand. Uh, she just gets really rambunctious, and it's, it takes sometimes a coordinated team effort to get her to calm down to, to actually get some sleep. Um, so we, um, um, well, we get her to bed and then it's like I fall asleep or she falls asleep. And so got some decent sleep, uh, last night. Um, we are planning save the date photo shoots. We are looking at a number of hikes that provide a, a great view. Uh, you know, not very, not, a, not very difficult hikes. Uh, just basically uh, an easier hike to get to a destination with a nice view um, and contemplating whether to, to and try to decide whether to do it in the morning or in the evening time when the sun's setting because either one of those we will need to have a child care uh, a child care child care set up you know so we need to have um, you know grandma uh, grandpa watching the kid um, so and also we have to have we're gonna hire my friend's wife um, who does a lot of the family portraits uh, and um, you know newborn shots so we're gonna use her and also I mean, the cool thing about that is uh, she's actually outdoorsy as well she loves the outdoors she loves hiking and um, my friend her husband is uh, an employee at REI and, um, you know, that's one of the things that we really have in common is the, you know, our passion for the outdoors and, um, hiking and stuff like that. So, um, yeah, so we're trying to decide on a number of hikes, uh, probably going to get that done next weekend for save the dates, uh, because we did save the date. It's going to be June 30th, 2019. Uh, we have the venue, uh, it's Genesis farms in Enumclaw and, um, we just need to start finding, you know, uh, contractors with, uh, for vendors of food, um, whether or not we want a DJ, wedding coordinator, uh, party supply places, you know, for seats, chairs and all that, you know, it's, it takes a lot of coordination, but it's honestly, if I get, if I can sit down and think about it for a while, I can, I can take care of it. It's not that difficult. It's just the wedding planning thing. It's, it shouldn't be that difficult. I've been to a number of weddings. I've been to probably over 10, you know. <laughs> I'm not sure if that's a lot, but at this point in my life, I've done enough and I've been behind the scenes enough to understand that what kind of goes into it. Um, so uh, we're getting that taken care of probably next weekend. Um, we are unfortunately going to miss our, our two weeks, I'm sorry, because in uh, not this weekend, but next weekend is my friend's kids birthday party and we're we've already um scheduled a float of the yakima river uh with with friends uh family i guess it's uh god parents um but we planning on doing that and the guy that's uh we're going with is uh officiating our wedding next year so it's you know it's not like it's just some random person or uh you know, a semi-close friend, it's close friends that we love and, um, that have accepted me, so, um, you know, there's details about that that I won't go into, but it's, uh, it was, um, it was one of those things where it's like I came in after their relationship was already established and there was a little bit of a hesitation to like me, um, because of what has taken place in the past, not, a, not for me, but for other people, so... Um, yeah, so it's, it's a great relationship, uh, between the families, and so I'm looking forward to that, but I hate having to miss my friend's kid's birthday party, and that's the second one, too. Um, it just happens with scheduling, it's just, uh, things, we schedule things out so far in advance that, you know, when things come up on a shorter notice, it, it tends to, like, conflict with it, and it's, when we're already leaving town, it's like I can't, you know you can't make both work, unfortunately, or you can, but it's just extremely time consuming, um, and requires two vehicles and, 
and uh, juggling of schedules, and so uh, that's just the difficult part of it. Um, but as for um, this weekend, we might be doing a hike, uh, I believe, on Sunday, and I'm con- uh, contemplating going up to Olympic National Park, going up to Hurricane Ridge. Um, there's one called the, I forget the name of it, it's like Dealine Ridge or something like that. It's a like 3.6, it's a, it's a loop basically, but it goes around a lake and it has this great vantage point, uh, or it's a nice loop. And um, so I'm kind of figuring out what, uh, if we're gonna be able to do that this Sunday. But uh, yeah, this weekend's gonna be, you know, we got Costco tomorrow, that's gonna be a huge bill. That's, uh, we haven't gone in a, at least a month. Uh, yeah, and today I have my Harrison assessment debrief certification test. Um, I'm going to practice all morning. I have it, it's at like, I think at noon, from noon to three. And it's going to be a long phone conversation. I need to close my door and get privacy. It's going to be long. A little nervous about it. I'm anticipating having to do it twice, um, like most people do, because I'm going to take the feedback that I get during the uh, debriefing and um, utilizing and, in, and implementing it in my own presentation. So I'm gonna see how that goes, but it's uh, I'm getting a much better grasp of the material and what goes into it. So anyway, I'm gonna keep this, I'll keep this for seven minutes. This is probably one of my longest videos, but um, yeah. So next weekend, we're gonna be doing the save the date photo shoots. Uh, I'm picking out the hike. Uh, I got the photographer picked and um, we're gonna see how it goes. So I'll keep you guys posted on that. Anyway, have a great weekend. Uh, have a great Friday. Uh, I'll be seeing you on Monday morning. Take care.